that's so how's it going today for you it's going pretty well it's good to see you again Beth, so you have such a unique background. So I wanna know more about your journey here into Amazon. Before becoming a military spouse, I was a young rising professional in the Fortune 500 and I truly thought I'm, I'm invincible. I didn't take into account the impact of multiple moves and what that would do to a career that might not necessarily be flexible to moving. Um, and the real blow came when we moved overseas. There's some outdated legis legislation that makes it really hard for military spouses to work overseas. And that was sort of the moment that catapulted me to where I am now. Um, I kind of ran into that obstacle and I said, this isn't right. So I started calling congressmen and senators. I spent five years overseas kind of fighting that fight from a distance. And then when I came back to the States, I started working for a nonprofit who also was advocating for military spouse employment. And it was actually through that advocacy work that I met my now boss um, who said, hey, you know, Amazon is really, we're, we're all in on hiring military spouses. We think that it's not just the right thing to do, but a smart thing to do. I would love to talk to you about what you're doing. Um, and that kind of brought me to where I am today. So it's a full circle moment for me. I started in Fortune 500. I'm back in Fortune 500, which is where I excel. And as a military spouse to sort of have your professional dreams realized, is is sort of moving in a way that I can't explain. It's motivating, it's empowering, it's inspiring to other military spouses. So really couldn't be a better story to, to where my career journey is currently. Quite a journey there for sure. So um, wanna know like, what does your day-to-day -day look like at Amazon? Um, I spend a lot of times in, meeting, in meetings kind of spreading the um, awareness of military spouses at Amazon, two different lines of business. I partner with teams that are looking to improve their diversity of hiring. Um, and then I also spend my time with nonprofits and small working groups with DOD to help further the cause of military spouse employment outside of the walls of Amazon. Wow, that's amazing. So it must be really rewarding for you to be able to do a job that you're really passionate about, right? It's beyond rewarding, uh, especially considering I was personally affected by the employment challenges of being a military spouse. And, you know, seven years ago was sort of um, holding on to a megaphone and, and screaming from desktops about military spouse employment. Um, and now being at a company that not only supports it, but advocates for it and allows me to continue to work outside of Amazon to move the needle forward for the entire community. Let's talk a little bit about like uh, affinity groups. So I'm a part of Glamazon. I see, you know, you are a part of warriors, people affiliated with the military or just interested, right? So tell me about, you know, being involved in that space, Beth. Yeah, the military spouse chapter of warriors actually is coming up on our one year anniversary. It brings that sense of community that military spouse are inherently drawn to right to your laptop, right to your front door. Um, it is such a fantastic way to tie in your work and that community involvement and community connection. How amazing. Yes, I love that. So now I want to kind of move into having some fun. So uh, I want to have some fun with some rapid fire questions, Beth. Are you ready for these? <laughs> okay, I'm ready. Let's do it. I'm ready. Okay, let's do it. Okay, cool. So favorite moment ever as a military spouse? The welcome home from a deployment, always, that first kiss, always. Ah, so sweet. Okay, favorite place you've ever lived? Germany. Favorite food in any place you've ever lived? Oh God, pho from Vietnam, specifically from Hanoi. Coffee or tea? Oh, black coffee all day, all day. How much have you saved on shipping with Prime? Oh. That's an embarrassing question because I order from Amazon every single day. So easily a couple grand. Here too as well. Yeah, totally. <laughs> <laughs> what is the last thing you bought on Amazon, Beth? Oh, this morning I bought a hairdryer and AirPods for my husband. Cool. Good choices. Beth, this was great. Um, great chat today. Great to see you again. You too. Thank you. Speaking of Amazon, uh-oh, my prime guy is here. 